The street outside Israel's embassy in London has been a regular meeting point for demonstrators showing solidarity with Palestinians, particularly since Israel's 22-day war on Gaza. But this time it was the turn of hundreds of members of the ultra-Orthodox Jewish community to protest. They believe that Zionism and Judaism are two distinct and incompatible schools of thought. The hundreds of ultra-Orthodox Jews who've gathered here go as far as to say that Israel itself is a source of Jewish suffering and anti-Semitism. They believe that Israeli society doesn't represent Judaism and Israel's very existence is against the teachings of the Torah. We believe that the time will come when Messiah will come, that is when the Jewish people will go back to Jerusalem. But we will not do that by force, we will not, we will not do that by an army, we have no entitlement to kill others for our ambitions. True Judaism has absolutely nothing in common with the state of Israel. They do not represent us and we do not believe in them. Any act done by them has nothing to do with Jews. The Orthodox Jews here in London also claimed that their friends in Israel were being mistreated by the authorities for holding similar protests and wanted to leave Israel to seek asylum elsewhere. The gathering, although attended by close to a thousand people, was largely ignored by the British media. But the protest follows similar larger actions in the US during a recent visit by Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Hassan Ghani, Press TV, London.